Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's session, we will see multiple choice questions based on the topic pointers in C programming language. Let's start with the first question. A pointer is a variable which stores dash of another variable. Options are name, value, address, all of the above. And correct answer is address. Because the definition of pointer Pointer is a variable which stores the address of another variable. Which of the following is an address operator? Option A, Option B, Option C or Option D? Yes, correct answer is Option B. We are using the ampersand sign. Which of the following is not an advantage of pointer? Accessing array element is faster. Option B. Support dynamically allocated memory. Option C. It reduces program complexity. Option D. It decreases program execution speed. And correct answer is it decreases program execution speed. It is a not an advantage of a pointer. Pointer initialization is the process of assigning address of a variable to a pointer variable. Options are true, false, maybe, can't say. And correct answer is A, true. Pointer initialization is the process of assigning address of a variable to a pointer variable. Which of the following is dereferencing operator? Options are A, ampersand, B, hash, C, char, and D, pointer. Okay, so correct answer is C. We are using the asterisk or value at address operator as a dereferencing operator. Which of the following operator also known as value at address operator? Yes, the answer is covered in previous question only. The star is known as a or asterisk is known as a value at address operator. Ampersand and star or asterisk are two pointer operators which are binary, option B, ternary, option C, unary or option D, logical. Okay, and these two are the unary operator. The size of pointer variable is same for all types of pointers but the memory that will be accessed while dereferencing is different, true or false. See, size of pointer variable is same for all type of pointer, but the memory that will be accessed while dereferencing is different. Different. Yes, it's the correct. This is true. Pointer arithmetic is somewhat different from ordinary arithmetic. True or false? Yes, it's a false. Pointer arithmetic is somewhat different from ordinary arithmetic. Which of the following type of address of stored in a pointer variable? Means when you are storing the pointer variable, which type of value uh, address stored inside this? Character, floating, integer or none of these? And correct answer is C, integer. Because it's storing the address of something and address can't be a character or floating. So correct answer is C, integer. Dash operator can be applied to pointer variable, division operator, multiplication, logical, casting. And correct answer is B. Casting operator can be applied to pointer variable. Expression pointer i plus plus and plus plus pointer i are same or not. It's same or not. I plus plus means post increment and plus plus i means a pre increment these are not same so correct answer is b false which function allocates an array of num bytes and leave them initialized options are calloc b malloc c pre and d realloc so which function we are using to allocate an array of num bytes we are using the memory allocation function malloc. Option B is answer. The pointer which can point or access whole the residence memory of RAM, that is 
which can access all 16 segments is known as which pointer. See, here is a confusion between the question. Sometimes the question for the far pointer and sometimes this is question for the huge pointer. So, you need to read it carefully and depending on the options, please do the answer. Here, options are segment pointer, huge pointer, pointer to pointer, none of these. And correct answer is, sorry, correct answer is B, huge pointer. Mistakely, I have written A. So, the correct answer is B, huge pointer. The pointer that has not been initialized till its first use is known as the dash pointer. Okay, and options are segment, huge, pointer to pointer, wild pointer. And the correct answer is the wild pointer. This pointer has not been initialized in its first use. So, this is known as wild pointer. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching till the end. If you like my video, please subscribe to my channel. Share this video with your friends. If you have any query, please write your comment in the comment box. I will try to solve all the queries.